So we're in video number 81 called Quick Select and this is a handy way of making sure you can get hold of multiple items inside your drawing and uh, so we're going to get straight on with this. If you'd like to open up your drawing number 81 and you can work along with me. Okay so place your mouse anywhere into fresh air and right click and Quick Select is one of the options down here. And this dialog box is the key to the whole thing. So let's read it down from the top. We're going to search the entire drawing. We're going to look for specific objects. Now, in this case, a block reference. And the properties are going to be the name of the block reference. So here we are. Here's the name. And as we come down here, this is the list of the names that we can look for. And we're going to come for our fluorescent tubes. And it says, search the entire drawing for a block reference using the name equal to EL fluorescent tube and include it in a new selection set. OK. So there are our fluorescent tubes. And up here in the properties, it tells us we've got block references brackets for in other words, four found in the selection set. So that's brilliant. So that's quickly selected our tubes and then we can do whatever we like with them. We could put them onto a new layer or we could change their properties in some way or we could delete them or just count them. Just counting them is a really big issue. Good. So let's try it with something else. So let's say that we want uh, the electrical double switch socket outlets that we have on our electrical layer 2. What we can do is we can do a double select. We're going to do a quick select here and we're going to select all of the blocks. So entire drawing and we're going to select all of the block references that are on the layer equal to ELEC02. And we're going to include those in a new selection set. Now, of course, we've got more than we want, so we can do an exclude as well. So we're going to say quick select again. And we're going to say we want to get the block reference. And this time we're going to say by name. And not equal to. So we're going to say exclude this search of any block reference that's not equal to the double switch socket outlet exclude it from our selection set and okay so now we're just left with block reference seven and they're all got the same name which is eldso 13 amp okay so by doing that double selection we've been able to isolate that particular block uh, with our quick select feature. Okay, let's do an escape and then let's have a look at something a bit more straightforward. On the quick select, we're going to say that we want to search the entire drawing for multiple objects, everything that resides and is equal to the layer A walls. So we can go and include everything on a walls in a new selection set and OK to that. Now, it's not that we want to necessarily count that, but we might want to move everything from a walls to another layer, which we can do no problem at all, which means that we've got a way now of consolidating information in our drawing. OK, now there's hundreds of different uses for quick select. And you might want to have a little play so you could pick up all of your dimensions, for instance, and then update the styles, all sorts of things.